years, both season and both averaging double digits a game. So here we go. 2-0 and in Region in Region 10. Park City and 2-0 in Region 10. Union. Union, two tournaments they went to uh, this year. They, they did not win a game. That's the Green River Tournament and the Steve Hudson Cancer Classic. Other than that, they've beaten Tooele and South Summit. So they've got four wins on the year, Union does. And uh, Park City's got wins over Bear River. North Sand Pete and one win in the Steve Hodson Cancer Classic over Grantsville, a one point win there. Park City winning a lot of close games. Rattling out rebound for Sam Carver. Kingdom, rebound for Union with the ball, Carver Simpkins. Park City's also got a victory over South Summit this year. Over left, Wood has the ball into Merrill. Merrill twisting, turning, double team back out to Simpkins. Jonah has it again, back up top, Kafusi. Now off right, Alex Horrocks. Moving it around, Merrill inside, he's got position. Little shot, no good, but Horrocks has the rebound. No good off the putback, Kafusi rebound again for Union. Wood with a foot on the line, man it's good. I was gonna say no good, but it rolled back in. Two points for Jonah Wood, they get out to a two nothing lead one minute into this first quarter. Park City on the other side, 33 has the ball. That's Boston Van, Van Der Vuer, and he misses the shot. So Union back the other way. Carver Simpkins going left, elbow. Now back over to Wood, up top Horrocks. Get you familiar with these names. Looking inside to Merrill again, there he goes on the block. Nice fake right, back out top to Kafusi. wants the three, no, he's not gonna take it. Merrill from 10 feet away, twisting, turning. Now back out, no hurry from these Union Cougars, which is good, they're working for a good shot. Wear down this Park City team early on, de on the defensive end. Park City playing kind of a lax man-to-man. -man. They're hanging off until their, their man gets the ball about the three-point line. Merrill inside, up, no good, air ball, defended by Ryan Sherman. He's got four inches on Ryan Sherman. On the other side, Park City with the three-point shot. It's short, rebound, Wood knocks it away. Horrocks has got it. Three-point shot attempt was by Tom Wood. 5'11 guard for Park City, number 21. So far, the clock's just running. Five and a half, first quarter, 2-0 Union Cougar lead into Kafusi. Horks to Wood, on the cut, no good. Merrill rebound, up off the glass, good, and count it, he's fouled. He's going to the free throw line to shoot for the three point play. He's got two points, and the foul goes to, that's number three, Sam Kingdom. And the first foul of the game, which puts Merrill on the free throw line. Three point play, the old fashioned way. I think radio and TV announcers have been saying that for years, but it's the truth. 5-15, first quarter. Park City so far, just a couple outside shots. Now baseline drive from 10 feet. No good, that shot by Boston Van de Vuur. He's a sophomore. It was a good look, just off the, uh, it went a little left. Off the back of the iron. Wood, Jonah Wood. There's a Tom Wood on Park City side, so I'll call him Jonah. Alex Horrocks into Jonah. Twist and turn, now to Merrill from five feet fakes, under the backboard, he's got nowhere to go. Park City comes up with the ball, four and a half, first quarter. Boston has the ball back up top. Sam Kingdom, and no good, it's short. They're coming in, shooting short. Park City is still almost halfway through this first quarter. Still shut out, Park City. And they only travel 10 as well for the boys team. We mentioned that for the girls team, but this boys team only has 10 players dressed for this game. Alex Horrocks off the backboard, no good. He had, he had a moment he could, have, uh, he could have taken a little bit more time on that shot. Park City the other way, Boston Van de Vuur out to 21, Tom Wood, and it rattles out. Sometimes you're just that far off. Jonah to Kafusi, now stolen away. Kafusi hits the ground, Van de Vuur against Horrocks. There are Carver Simpkins, and now the foul from behind is gonna go on Jonah Wood. 
So there's going to be free throw attempts for Boston Van de Vuur. Three forty-seven, first period. This could be the first point for Park City. It is a free throw. Second shot up and good, perfect. All right, a little full court action, a little trap put on by Park City to Merrill. Merrill to Wood and it's tipped away. Park City comes up with it. Van de Vuur has it. Over to Kingdom, now back to Van de Vuur. Can't decide if I want to just call him Boston or Van de Vuur. Boston with an E in. There's Kingdom, a good shot, two points. Kingdom with two. Okay, so five to four, Union's five point lead, cut down to one, 313 first quarter. Jonah Wood, left hand, turns back to the right, up and good, he's going to the free throw line. Second three point opportunity for the Union Cougars, he's got four points now, Jonah Wood. And a chance to get one more at the line. That foul is going on Kingdom. That's two on Kingdom already. So he's going to be taken out. Subbing in. Looks like number five, Connor Anderson. Connor Anderson, number five. Jonah Wood at the free throw line, 307 first quarter, and it's good. So far, taking advantage of three point plays with their bigs. So far, Park City's key to the game. They haven't shut down the bigs yet. Nice shot off the front of the rim, just barely out. That shot was by Boston and a rebound and a foul on the rebound. Ryan Sherman comes up with it, and let's see who they call the foul on. It's going to be on Union, of course, uh, and the foul is on Horrocks, number 20. So Park City to inbound underneath. And a quick shot from Anderson. It's good. Comes into the game, scores right off the bat. Connor Anderson with those two points. Number two into the game, Landon win for Union. Back out to Jonah Wood for three, no good. Off the bar, so it's out of bounds. So it's Park City ball, eight to six, the score. Good crowd here tonight for this boys game. The boys last year and uh, the year before were playing at 515 for their varsity home games. The girls at seven o'clock, this year they swapped. Boston goes left, running out of room. Quick three-point shot, long and way off by Hayden Daly. He averages 14 points a game. Didn't even see the rim until after he let go of the ball, I'm sure. Landon Wynn up to Jonah Wood. Now back to Kafusi. Inside to Wynn. They want to give it to him. Nope. Back up top to Carver Simpkins. He's going to go right. Inside to Wynn. There we go. Isolate on the block, back up top, Jonah Wood, fake from the elbow, now to win. Kafusi with the rebound. He has good position if he... Little Hayden Ross, no good. Union all over the rebounds, and uh, it's going to be Park City ball. They did whatever they could. Uh, Carver Simpkins was trying to, trying to box him out, trying to keep the ball away from, from Park City and uh, trying to save it himself, couldn't get to it. So Hayden Ross is in the game for Union. And 146, eight to six, the score. First quarter. Boston, inside. Ryan Sherman, twist, turns, off the back of the iron, win with the rebound for Union. Hayden Ross the other way, pushing it, minute and a half, first quarter. Carver Simpkins up top, win, has it from the elbow. Nice fake, he's gonna take it all the way, and one. There you go. That's exactly what they need to do all game long. Two points there for Landon Wynn, six foot three junior. Taking it to the rim, getting it in, and now a chance for a three point play. Wynn misses the free throw rebound, Park City. Here's a myth, calling two basketball games. Is just as good as a CrossFit workout. Yeah, that's false. Nice take for uh, 
A little wild shot though for Hayden Daly, Union back the other way. There's nothing that can match CrossFit. You, you never do more than you can. Stephen Merrill, two points right there. Never do more than you can, but they will push you to your limit and they will help you get the body that you want. CrossFit, uh, it's very personal. They'll, they'll suit your needs. CrossFit Avenue, a great sponsor of VTV Sports. About 1700 North Vernal Avenue. Go check them out. 40 seconds, first quarter, three point attempt. Simpkins Carver Brady. Simpkins. I'll tell you what, that is, uh, that's a clutch shot right there. And that gives the Cougars a nine point lead. 15 to six, 25 seconds, first quarter. Park City wants the last shot. They know Union's on a roll. They don't want to give up another turnover. So they're going to back off for another 10 seconds or so. 17, 16. Boston, Van de Vuur with the ball. All right, here comes the screen, eight seconds. Inside, nice give and nice cut, nice give. Tom Wood gets two points right there. One second, Hayden Ross from half court. <laughs> from our angle, it looked good, but it was way right. So 15 to eight, the score at the end of one quarter here at Union High School. We've got three exciting quarters left. Union off to a good start. Once again, 15-8 over the Park City Miners. We'll be back with second quarter action after this on BTV. BTV6 and Strata Webview proudly present Are you reaching your high school basketball goals? coverage? Do you have any? High definition. Are you tired of a season old coverage? routine? Have you considered having a trainer? Come in today to see what CrossFit has to offer. Our well-trained staff of personal trainers can help you reach a higher quality of life. Think CrossFit is for elite athletes only? Anyone with a desire can reach their fitness goals. CrossFit Avenue, committed to you and your quality of life. Moon Lake Electric was organized in 1938 as a rural electric cooperative by residents of northeastern Utah who were unable to obtain electric service from a private power company. The cooperative philosophy involves working together for the common good by providing a service that is beneficial to all. Moon Lake Electric is owned by those it serves and is a valuable community partner. We are proud to support the television coverage of you into Basin High School Sports. Back here just in time for the second quarter, Union 15, Park City 8, fresh eight minutes on the clock, second quarter at Union High School, Region 10 action, both teams 2-0. Both teams have uh, beat Juan Diego, Park City beat Wasatch, and Union beat Uinta, the Crosstown rival, which they will play again here on VTV and Strata.tv coming up later on next month. Kafusi with the ball left-hand side, Hayden Ross in the game, Stephen Merrill, Carver Simpkins, and Wynn land and win for the Cougars. Working the baseline, Wynn's got the ball up top. Hayden Ross, nice little fake. Merrill from 17, no good. That, that was a pretty good looking shot. 7.36. Merrill, five points so far tonight. In there at 6.8. Taking up a lot of space. Inside, nice spin, turn. Ryan Sherman missing the shot, rebound. Hayden Ross the other way for the Cougars. Merrill screen. Ross getting in there. Oh, little flick of the wrist, almost got it. Park City the other way. Nice drive by Boston, and he's going to go to the line for a chance to get a three point play. Boston Van de Vuur with four points. 7 on 3, second quarter, 15 10. And he's got two free throws already this evening. Kingdom is in for Sherman. Also on the floor for Park City. Number 21, Tom Wood. Number 15, Hayden Daly. Boston Van de Vuur, Sam Kingdom, and Anderson's out there. Connor Anderson. All right, five points for Van de Vuur. 15-11. Union up top, Ross inbound to Jonah. Back to Ross, over to Carver. In the corner, he's gotta get out of there. That's what you don't want right there. Easy layup for Park City, missed. Carver Simpkins with the rebound, now get it back the other direction. Jonah Wood across midcourt. 
and now slowing it down as they set up the offense. Oh, he tries the crossover stolen by Park City. They've got to call a foul on that. That's a little too much body. But uh, it's going to be Park City ball with the jump ball. Boy, he about took out his legs going for that ball. Anyway, 15-11. Maybe it's good no call. Letting them play a little bit. That's never been a bad thing. 6.41 on the clock, second quarter. Ashley Regional Medical Center, proud sponsor of these games on BTV. Got the most techno technologically advanced radiology services in northeastern Utah, including the Hawkeye 4 nuclear medicine machine and 64 slice CT scanner. So if you need a CT done, that's the place to go. Two locations, Vernal and Roosevelt. They've got a Roosevelt clinic that offers full services, lab, x-ray, and women's health. Park City maintains possession, 15-11. Spin on the block, double dribble. They got it. Turnover, Park City. Union's got the ball back. No pressure from Park City this time down. 618. Jonah Wood. Merrill getting physical down there on the block. Back around, Kafusi down on this near block. Now Jonah high post, elbow shot, and no good. Rebound, Merrill, don't bring it down that far. He puts it back up, he's gonna go to the free throw line. If he kept it up above his head, he may have had a better chance, but he brought it down to his chest. I think he was a little off balance when he landed, trying to get his balance back. 15-11, Merrill at the free throw line. And one point from the free throw line so far tonight. There's two as he gets that one to roll in. Six points so far into the game for Park City. 24, returning in Sherman. And Merrill misses, but Wood has the rebound off the glass. No good. Ball knocked around, but Anderson gets it for Park City. Jonah Wood steals it, and is it going to go out of bounds? No, he knocks it up Anderson. Anderson goes into the bleachers trying to save it. Jonah Wood with a hustle play right there, and it remains Park City, or a Union ball. 5.54, second quarter clock. Love the hustle plays this part of the game. It really adds up. If you, uh, if you hustle this part of the game, it'll just carry over as the game continues. 16-11, second quarter. Jonah Wood, 17 no good. Kafusi rebound. Now knocked over to Simpkins. Underneath the Merrill, he loses it, but they're going to call a foul down on the ground, so it's not going to be free throws. It's the fifth foul, team foul for Park City. Hayden Ross inbound. And to Jonah. Right side. Nothing down low. Little high post action from Merrill right now. Five and a half, second quarter. Kafusi, good shot, little long. Rebound, Park City. Wide open, three, off right, air ball. Hayden Ross, rebound. 5-15, second quarter. Hayden Ross making them hustle back on defense. Now to Wood, three-point land, nothing there. Will he Back up top to Carver. Now to Kafusi, slowing it down. Merrill inside, working hard. Up off the glass, good. You can't, you can't argue with that kind of position right there. He worked hard for that position, and it was an easy shot because of it. Boston, nowhere to go. Jonah Wood on defense. Now back out to Sherman. And Kingdom, I'm sorry. Number three is Kingdom. Now number 15 is Daly. He takes a three, and it's good. Four and a half left, second period, 18-14. Jonah up top to Carver. Carver, left-handed dribble, stopped. Now baseline, 16-footer, no good. Rebound, Park City. And slowing it down, Boston's got it. Looking ahead. Little screen, he's got some space, but uh, it's gonna be on the ground, so no shot. A foul on the ground, and that's going to be 14 fouls on the Cougars. 
Coming into the game for the Cougars, we've got number two again. That is Landon Wynn, and making the first appearance, Jace Woolston Hume. Woolston Hume guarding the inbounder right there, number 35. There you go. Easy eight foot shot now. Kafusi's in the air, but Jonah taps it out of bounds off the pass. On the ground, Park City recovers, and now they'll slow it back down. Boston wants to take a baseline. I knew he was going to do that. Up off the glass and good and count it. No, it's a charge. It's a charge and foul right there on Boston Van Devuer. Great defense. Kafusi. All right, we're halfway through the second quarter. 3.59, second quarter. 18-14 in favor of Union. Landon win with the ball, now to Jonah. Wilson, he wants it, now he gets it underneath to win. Oh, that's gonna be a foul, a little shove off, uh, offensive penalty right there on the Cougars. Landon win. kinda used his arms to create some space, an illegal way. 340, second quarter, 18-14. Way to use that screen, easy elbow jumper, short, rebound, Wolstein, he knocks it, and blocked from behind, that's, that's a great block by Jonah Wood, but they're, oh man, you can hear the, the fans aren't happy with that one either. Sometimes you, uh, you anticipate that it's gonna be a foul, I thought it was clean. But so far they've been letting him play pretty good. Sam Kingdom at the free throw line, two points so far, and the free throw is good. So 14, uh, I mean 15, 18. Union with the lead, a three-point lead. And second one is good, four points for Sam Kingdom. Now some pressure, trap. Jonah Woods got it in the middle, over to Kafusi. And now Park City settles back into a half-court defense. Three eleven, second quarter. Jonah, nice jump stop. Whoa, he really swung. That wasn't Jonah, that was Wynn, I'm sorry. Wolstein Hume going for the rebound. Win with the rebound off the rim. Now you've got Jonah, he's got fouled, and he's going to the free throw line. The kit basket does not count. I think Wolstein Hume originally did that big jump stop. Jonah Wood, though, a great rebound right there and a put back. He got fouled on it so far, five points. 13 point average, so he's just about where he should be. Six points now. Three minutes even, second quarter. And Jonah Wood misses. Wynn trying to get in there for the rebound. They're gonna keep it. They're gonna give it to the Cougars. Off of Park City. And Stephen Merrill comes in for Jonah Wood, 19-16. Cougar. Hayden Rost inbound. Wilston Hume, nice fake, gets the baseline, now he's in trouble, and it's knocked out of bounds. Or intercepted out of bounds. 19-16, 2.55 on the clock. Kafusi, corner, doesn't want the shot. Hayden Ross up top, Wilston Hume, back to Ross. Keep away. Fusi holding on to a two and a half second quarter. Union's led the whole game. Merrill free throw line. He's got he's got position right now. Off the glass, no good, but he's going to the free throw line. That foul on Ryan Sherman. Number 24, that's his uh, first foul. 2.20, second quarter clock. Merrill at the free throw line. Merrill's got seven points so far, two three-point plays, and another deuce. It's up and good. Into the game, Simpkins for Ross. There you go, another one. Merrill's got nine points. 
for big 5-0. 2-19 second quarter. Some tight D being played. Park City loves to shoot it from the outside, but they'll get it inside occasionally too. Ryan Sherman fouled right there, and I believe they are now in the bonus. Will Stein Hume with that foul, and yes, it's going to be the one and one. And Ryan Sherman to shoot one and one. So far, scoreless. Ten points a game is what he averages, but nothing here today. Number 13, Logan Holbrook coming in for Park City Miners. He's a 5'8 guard sophomore. Young looking kid. One and one's missed. We'll say Hume over the back. No call because it was simultaneous between him and Landon Wynn. And poor little Park City guy just kind of got stuck in between. So Union down with the rebound. Simpkins back to Wolstein Hume. Left handed dribble over to Kafusi. I'd like to see Kafusi take a shot. He's he's got he's got some space usually. Win having it knocked away and out of bounds by Boston, and it will remain Cougar ball. Kafusi, you know, he does the triple threat stance where he fakes the shot. You can also pass and dribble out of that. But uh, he, he, I haven't yet to see him shoot. Merrill, nice move. Off the rim, no good. Rebound, Kafusi. Oh, he's thinking of getting Carver inside. It's knocked away by Park City, so it remains Union ball. It's a good thought. Kafusi, a little no-look uh, bounce pass. Carver wasn't cutting. Minute 35, second quarter. And stolen away by Park City. This is not good. Wide open layup. Kafusi uh, conceding the layup. And that's by Boston Van de Vuur. He's got seven points. Yep, seven points for the Park City Miners. 27 18, 21 18, I'm sorry. Union with the lead. 1 15 on the clock, second quarter. Win over to Simpkins inside of Kafusi. There he goes. Take your nope. He, he'd rather give it up to Merrill, and it's knocked out of bounds. So it remains Union ball. 65 seconds remaining in the game in the second quarter. This half. So far, not a lot of scoring this quarter. So far, Wolstein Hume, Merrill swinging over to Simpkins. Foot on the line. It looks like it's out. Rebound, Park City. Few unions on the Union Cougars on the floor. Pass, 21. He's no good. That's Tom Wood. No good for Wood. And 45 seconds for Union. Now the coach is telling him to slow it down. Win. Wolstein Hume, and he loses it. It's going to be a backcourt violation. Park City gets it off the turnover, 33.5 seconds. Not a good turnover to have. Alex Horrocks back in the game for the Cougars. And Ross is back in. With the ball, Boston Van de Vuur. And he's just going to watch the clock. <laughs> Almost caught him a little off guard there. Ten seconds. Alex Horks all over him. Up top, three-point attempt is no good. Short rebound over the back. And the Cougars with 3.3 seconds left are going to go to the free throw line. I believe it's going to be landed win. Two points so far today has a chance to take the Cougars into the locker room with a five-point lead if he knocks these two down. And Park City doesn't get any points the other direction. Oh, it's going to be Kafusi at the line. So far, no shots taken, no points. Just a defensive and offensive presence. Great rebounder. Shot is no good. Merrill fighting for the rebound. Nobody gets it. One second left. And that shot is way over. 
the backboard. And the end of the half is here. 21-18 is the score. The Union Cougars over the park.